so hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel and welcome back to my new brand and very informative video so i am your friend hasnan and you are watching lbs tech so in this video i am going to be tell you how to fix for you cannot open the page because the address is invalid so how we can fix this problem so in this video i am going to be tell you so first of all go back to the home screen and before starting the video it's somebody request to watch my video completely until the end and don't skip my videos and if my videos are informative and very branded for you then please don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel and hit the bell icon for my new video so hope this sell so without wasting any time let's get started the video so first of all guys simply i will tell you first method to solve your problem now here you have to simply go to your setting app in your device and after opening your setting app now here you have to simply scroll it down now here you have to type on the wi-fi and here you have to make sure that if your wi-fi is connected to your device so if your wi-fi is not connected to your device so here you have to connect your wi-fi into your device so after this here you have to simply go back to the setting page and if you are using any cellular data or mobile data now here you have to check that your cellular data or mobile data is connected to your device so if your cellular data is not connected to your device so you have to connect your mobile data into your device so after this here you have to simply go back to the home screen and check that your problem has been fixed or not so I hope if you are still facing this issue so here I will tell you next method to solve your problem now here simply go to your setting app in your device and after that here you have to simply scroll it down now here you can see general option so let's type on it here and when you type on general option then you have to simply scroll it down now here you can see shutdown option so let's type on it here and when you type on general option then you have to select to power off your device for some minutes and after that restart your device again and here you have to put your enter code passcode so here i will put the password here and after restart your device now here you have to check that your problem has been fixed or not so if you are still facing this issue so here i will tell you third method to solve your problem now here you have to simply scroll it down now here you have to find sorry app and let's open it and after that here you have to simply scroll it down till the end now you can see advanced option so let's type on it here and now you can see first option website data so let's type on it here now you can see this is my website data so here you can sit down remove all website data so let's type on it here and you can see this will clear data that could be used for tracking but is also used by websites to preserve login information and to speed up browsing now here you have to type on the remove now and after that here you have to simply go to this for you page and after that here you can see clear history and website data so let's type on it here and now you can see clear history and data so let's type on it here and that you have to type on the close tabs and after this from all these methods so go back to the home screen and check that your problem has been fixed or not so if your problem will not be fixed from this method so i tell you fourth method to solve your problem now here go to your setting app in your device and now here you have to simply scroll it down now type on the general and after that here you have to type on the transfer or reset iphone and now here you have to again type on the reset and after that you can see a lot of option is present here now here you have to type on the reset your all setting and after that put your enter code passcode so here i will put the password here and after that you can see reset all settings so you have to simply type on the reset all setting and when you type on reset all setting then you have to simply go back to the home screen and check that your problem has been fixed or not so guys from all this method i hope your problem has been fixed if your problem has been fixed then please don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel and hit the bell icon for my new video so hope this helped thanks for your time today and i will see you on the next one